Hello everybody, this is Techno Paladin. Welcome back to Factorio, our noob to mega base Clindathu playthrough, where this is me, a noob, in our first ever playthrough of Factorio as we make mistakes and have fun doing it on our way to a mega base. In our last episode, uh, well, I was working on getting artillery manufacturing complete. And while it is very, and I do mean very, slow, uh, we have ammo being produced. So that's the good thing. Uh, we actually almost have two full boxes. Go figure. Okay, this is definitely not an even distribution, but uh, considering that this box car only holds essentially one crate worth, um, doesn't need a whole lot. Um, so let's see, let's come down here to some of these that aren't running. And so we need more radars. Well, this one's got radars. That one's working just fine. So explosives making its way through radar. Radar production can go up is basically what it looks like. Let's see, do we have enough uh, space for more radars? Uh, well, I mean, it looks like it's just, it needs more green circuits, uh, which needs more coils. Got it, got it, got it. Okay, let's do this. Let's, uh, let's add a few more coils here into the mix. Can I, do I have enough room? Well, I got one. We can probably do two. All right, there's that, and then let's just do 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 do. Okay, so that should keep all the green circuits happy now, and actually let them all run. Let's just see. This is just kind of watching it here for a minute. So the main order of business right now is I've wanted to increase our production of our shells really quick. Uh, just trying to make sure that we can get what we want done. So let's see, is this doing okay now? That's doing better. We can probably put one more on here because, well, we got room. See, if we stick it right there, it'll be just in the power envelope. And do, 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 do. Okay, so that should get us more than enough now. I'm trying to make sure if I see if I can get enough here to, uh, uh, without any modules get enough that we won't run out of it. I want to see if it'll start backing up, because if it'll start backing up, then I can potentially add one more green circuit. But it looks like we're just about right on the money with keeping it going, so. But it is starting to back up a little bit here. So I might be able to just do this. And let's go blue and our red. Okay, and then let's get that one down. Okay. So that'll get us three of these guys going. So that should help help with this a little bit. It takes about 20 seconds, I think it said, for an artillery shell. So that's going to start getting down here. I could move that to the end, so that way it optimizes our line. And it looks like we got ammo starting to back up. Explosives are keeping up. The cannon shells are just keeping up. So we should start getting, hopefully, 
Let's see. We might we might be able to get through there. All right. Well, we're gonna start coming down here. We're starting to get more of our shells produced. This is now full. So that's 48 shells. Yeah, 48 shells. Okay. And this is almost full. So what's my train say? One of two. Which we should only say one of... Well, one of one right now, right? Max is two. Limit is seven. Wait, why is it seven? If this is holding... Like 4,000 times six. Uh, yeah, I think I might have done my math wrong here. 57k. Well, that's loading up. Let's see. Oops, don't stop, stop. Don't shoot my own stuff. Uh, sulfur is loading up. Sulfur probably doesn't load as f Or maybe it does. Hmm. Okay, there's a full box. Uh, 2.4k on sulfur. So, and the train limit here is 2 of 2. So, 2.4. Now the fun part. Calculators. Uh, yeah, because I... Let's see, two Oops. times six times two. So that's 28,000 is the max. So let's come in here. This is wrong. 28. Actually, let's do 27. Nine, nine. So that way, oh, nine. Just under. So now this is this plus this is output D. That's minus twenty seven. Did I not hook up? Oh. <laughs> okay, so it looks like I'm, I didn't hook up my thing here. There we go. So now this is saying that my limit should be zero because we're about full. Whoopsie. So that's probably what I did over here too. Uh, yep, I forgot to hook up the boxes to the combinator. Well, that would be a bit of a problem. And... How full is this guy? Let's see this one. 3.9. Do we have any that are full? So that one's probably closer to what we want. So that means it's going to hold 48 stacks of 100. So 4,800 4, times 6 times 2. So that's the 57.6. So yeah, it's 5,700. That's good. Okay. So this guy here now has a limit of 1 because we're not quite there. Good, 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 good. Uh, so that's starting to look better. So this guy here is 48 times 6 times 2. 576. Uh... Well, this is a provider, so we don't really care. This is not divided by 8k. This is divided by 48. Right? Or no, this holds 40. Divided by 40, or do I do 80? Because 80 would be a full train. So what's this limit? Zero of two. Limits four, max two. Good, good, good. Okay. So yeah, because I can get a limit of quite a few trains in here, but we have a max of two, so the max is working. Good. 
Okay, so our provider process is working. So soon we'll have full, you know, a bunch of these full. These are almost all full. So now we need, I don't know if I actually have any of these being made because I made it by hand the last time. So we need to come back up to our, our uh, base where we have all the oil production, where we have a bunch of stuff being made. And I need to be careful and watch out for trains because I have, I got hit, my, my car got hit by a train earlier. Uh, that iron's kinda getting there. Well, the steel, iron, yeah. We can definitely add some more into that and we probably will. Let me get up here. Like I need to add like roads with walls so that way I don't hit the train. But that would remove half the fun. Okay, so here's our... Still having some problems with this oil. I might have to adjust that still. Alright, let's... uh. Any trains coming? There is. Let's get out of the way. Where's the train going? Or was it going the other way? Might have been going the other way. Okay, so this is kind of where I want to be. We have some concrete over here. So we need concrete red circuits, steel, and gears. So let's come down here. Let's just set up a, a process to make these first. Um, I actually think I have a spare unit that I wasn't using. Where is it? Oh, this is it, but it doesn't have access to red circuits. Um, Has the steel, has the gears, just needs red circuits. So let's do a box. I might just have to put red circuits in a box. And we'll do that. And then we can do that. And then we just go that. And oh, I need to get concrete too. Let's change this to a that. And then we can put some concrete in there, and then we'll put some red circuits in there as well. Let's, uh, and to do that, let's uh, come down here. I'm just gonna create a little box that's gonna pull red circuits. So I can, uh, no, 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 no. Uh, that's pulling the stone, let's do can I do a filter on the box? No, but I need a filter insert, which I don't have any built right now. So let's come down here. Do I have a spot I can just throw? Uh, I don't. Mm. All right, let's see. How do I want to do this? How many red circuits does it need? 20 per? Okay, that's going to take a lot. Uh, Let's see, can I get the red circuits over there? I can. What does concrete need? Uh, concrete needs water, iron, stone. Okay, well, we have that being made up here. So let's just go ahead and bring the stone brick in. Or I should say the concrete. Let's uh, let's take what we can fit for the moment, and let's come down here, and we're going to uh, ooh, how do I want to do this? Um, 
let's let's put this over on this side. Spaghetti logistics at your service. So then we can come in here and just go concrete, and then I'm gonna go grab a grab a handful more stacks. Okay. And then we're gonna route some red circuits over here. We're gonna go boom. And then I'll just go fill it up here in a minute. But we're going to take our little friend right here. Go boom, boom. Then we're going to rotate it and go boom, boom. And then we're going to rotate it over and we're going to bring it. Uh, oh, wait. I needed to go up some more still. Dang it. Uh, that's not what I wanted to do. I need to come up here, rotate it, and then now we go over. There we go. Now we got red circuits going where we need it to go. So this should start producing our artillery cannon turrets. Uh, we got four we can go put somewhere. And then once this lab research gets complete, I'm going to kick off logistics. Because uh, we need to get these extra chests going and then start making some logistics bots. So we can get these things going. So let's see. We got uh, that being made now. So let us go forth. And find my car. And we are going to go up north. I think that's where we're going to start with our uh, diplomatic passage delivery. Is the is the east and north side of our upper base here. Once I get through all this mess, let me just plow through that tree. Oh, come on, really. Let us go forth. All right, now here's where I, I got blowed up last time. Um, because for some reason, I have a box right here with a ton of solid fuel in it. Um, I don't remember why I did that, but I did. Go figure. Okay, so we have trains coming in. Got trains doing all their things. We got those trains doing their things, this train doing that thing. I want to start getting to the point where we can start making our next circuit build. But first, I want to come up here. Let's see. Yeah, we need to add our dispensary up here. Okay, so what's the what's the range on this turret? Let's take a look here. Uh, boom. So if I come in here and I put this turret down. I have to look in the map view, I think, to see the range. If I, uh, I maybe I can't see the range. Let's uh, well here, let's um, drop it right there for now, and let's just see if I can see the range then manually. Okay, so that'll take out these three bases which is perfect and then if I put down an additional turret let's put it about right there if I look in the map view that should give me coverage to there let me put down one more turret and then this, I think that'll conclude our need for this side of the house. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to set up a belt. Let's see, where am I going to have the train drop off? Um, I might have it drop off just right over here. Okay, well let's let's go set that up. I'm going to set up a, a simple 
pull out. Uh, so let's get a two car pull out. Do, do, do. We want to drop it like right in here. Let's let this all get dropped down. And uh, yeah, I think I need to add a few more um, signals to this too, I think. Let's get that signal there. And next, I think I needed one here, if I remember right. Maybe it was right here. That closes the loop. Yeah, I think that does it. Okay. So this guy here, we're going to name this, uh, uh, where's my artillery? So let's do this, but we're going to see, uh, D. And I'm just going to do a D1, because those are all going to be D1. Oh, you know what? I need to, let's come in here to the pictograms, D, dash, and then one. Enter. Okay, so that's going to be this. Um, yeah, now we have the train. So now I'm just going to set up a, a off offload. Now these only, this, these trains don't get a whole lot. Um, so let's just do two. I think that will probably be plenty. And then, uh, yeah, we need to get. Do, 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 do. And let's just do this. Let's go. And then we'll bring. How about like that? <laughs> and then we can just bring up this uh, track. Let's uh, let's go line it up here. I want to change these over to use drone logistics drones, which is why I want to uh, get this kind of situated. Uh oh. Uh, hey, Mr. Carr, do I have any goods on you? We need belts for our freedom dispensary. Uh, we have nothing in our car. Great. That's right, because my other car blew up and it had all the stuff in it. Yeah, I lost all those materials. Okay, so, well, uh, in that case, let's get this set up for delivery and some power. And then that way, we can get the train set up. And let's see, we need to get a one of these right there so that way it just gets everything into the grid and then I need my uh, requester station just do this I'm gonna set this down here and then we're going to set this to go box to box to box to box to input and then we're gonna come in here we're gonna change this to artillery artillery shells the quantity is 48 times uh, 2468 uh, see 96, 96, one. 92, yeah, 192, something like that. Okay, so, oh, you need power too? Yeah, I'll get you some power here. How about that? Okay, so the limit here, let's just see what's this uh, calculating out. Uh, Oh yeah, I gotta fix this. Um, 
So this is going into here. D divided by 48. Set. Um, let's just set that to L. Okay. And this is L times L. Or L times 1 to get the L. So limit 4. Max is 2. Um, in this case, the max is 1. Let's change this to 1. So, okay. So max is 1. Output is limit 1. So, let's get this layered into here. And then... That wired into there. And this set to send the train limit. Limit L. And so now it's a zero of one. So that's what we got. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go get some uh, supplies. And then we're gonna get these things hooked up. But well, I guess I could go ahead and uh, have this set up here. Uh, probably need to move that guy, huh? Yeah, I need to scoot him over. I need to scoot him back one, too. Alright, so let's, uh, let's delete that, delete that. Let's get you Mr. Turret. Uh, where, where'd you go? Down here. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. Okay. And then we can just go... Boom and boom. And boom. Okay. So that should get us what we need here with ammo. So we're going to go get some supplies and then we'll go down to our train and set the schedule. And that should. As long as I don't get hit by a train, look at the map. Look for trains. All right, let's go. So we'll be right back after we get some supplies. Okay, we have picked up some supplies and we decided to come down here and set up our train schedule first. So our train schedule is going to be pickup. So ammo pickup. And we're going to wait for full cargo. We're going to add ammo drop off. And wait for full cargo or empty cargo. And then, uh, or actually, I'm going to add this or a uh, inactivity because if we fill up that belt with uh, bombs, it's not going to do us any good, right? And then we're going to go to our fuel station and uh, go for inactivity. And then we've got some fuel in here. So that's going to be good for now, I think. So now if I go copy, I can go paste. So if I look here, uh, it's all set. So let's go automatic, fuel, let's go manual fuel. Ah, it's out of reach. Of course it is. Fuel. Okay, so it's got some too. So, okay, we're gonna go automatic. And then we're gonna come over here and tell him to go automatic. And we have our first ammo delivery being made as we speak. So now this is going to say destination full because the tr other train, we have it set to one stop. So let's get on the other side of this before the train gets here. Uh, before, well, let's get across this one before the train gets here. If I can get through without hitting rocks. Uh, nope, I hit some more rocks. Okay, let's get back up here. We'll be right back as I get up to, back to where we have our delivery. Okay, we are back. And it looks like we have our first delivery. Um, actually, maybe even our second delivery already occurred. So let's go ahead and get some of these uh, supplies in place. And what's, what's what complaining about what? Um, 
Oh, it wants my <laughs> concrete. Yep, yep, yep. All right, well, we're going to get this connected, and we're going to watch our uh, our uh, fun deliveries. Oh, come on. No, no, no. Give me... Why didn't it do the auto underground? All right, there we go. All right, so that's going to get us, and that's going to reduce the artillery shells here. And let's just, we're going to watch these things start taking out. And we have some turrets. Hopefully it's enough uh, between the flamers. Ooh. Can we zoom in and watch? Ooh, boom, look at that. Boom, boom. Boom. Uh oh, okay, here comes a wave. Time to see how well our uh, wall works. Oh, they might come feed over this way. Oh, but we got flamers, so. <laughs> Look at that. Bye bye, flame. Nice. All right, so, oh, and it looks like I guess I didn't have some of my wall actually built. <laughs> oh, I need to get my, uh, still got a little ways to go here with these. Got to get this last turret involved. And ka -choo, ka -choo. Look at that. Boom, 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 boom. Nice. And here comes some more customers for our flaming turrets. And it does look like it's, it's hitting some of these. I don't have full ammo in any of these guys because I don't have an ammo delivery system set up yet. But that's going to eat up a lot of shells doing this. I can't wait to get logistics going. Definitely need to work on getting our yellow science uh, up to snuff. Oh, well, so that those three turrets are going to help keep this area clear, hopefully. Not sure what that is, but... Uh, and then we're going to kind of... This one, we got one turret over here, which we can go give more ammo as well. Because I am full. I'll just go top off that one turret over there. We'll just do it manually for now. So now that we have our nice destruction being delivered automatically to the north. Let's uh, try not to get hit by a train. Let's come over here. Um, and hit, get hit, run into rocks, and we're gonna come over here. Got a nice little laser wall, and we have our. Oops, can't even, can't even drive in my own stuff. All right, uh, it's got, it has one at one turret, one shell left. Okay, let's just pick him up. Oh, and I can't. Uh, well, let's do this. Let's grab this guy, and I'm going to put him a little closer. Kaboom. Yeah. And then we're going to give it 15 shells, and it's going to start delivering some uh, diplomatic packages. And we're going to drop one up here. So we can get a couple of these friends over here, too. Uh, we only got a few ammo shells for it, but... Oh, it looks like those are in range, so they're going to go boom, boom, boom to each other. Nice. 
All right, the main reason why I wanted to focus to the north is we got a lot of iron patches up here. And uh, if we can if we can take them out, we can start getting expanding some further. Oh, nice. Okay. Well, that was uh, lovely. So that should give us a nice little bubble of protection for now. It looks like, uh, though he might need some more ammo. Oh, maybe not. He's got three shells left. Okay. So that's not too bad. So now we can focus on some expansion. Um, we're going to probably end up using all of our ammo in those trains over there. So let's see. How is our uh, lovely little operation here going? We have full light oil tanks. So that's good, uh, which means we should be getting plastic being made and we have solid fuel being made. Wow, we actually have the train coming back to get some more. Um, yeah, I guess he's full. <laughs> and he's full. So they're just kind of doing loops. Um, I probably need to change my conditions. Um, a little bit. Oh, that's, uh, that's a bottleneck I wasn't hoping for. Okay, let's, uh, let's go fix that. Just don't need those guys getting stuck right there. Oops, I keep running over these tracks. I hope I don't get hit. Okay, we need to put down a little signal here. Uh, we need one of these guys. Let's, uh, uh, oh, I need a stop. That's what I need. If I do that, I think that will let those guys go through. Wow, my ammo has almost got full belts here, too. Definitely need logistics drones for that. Um, but it looks like my lab hasn't moved. So let's go check out our yellow research, make sure it's uh, functioning. Because we need that so we can get logistics and start moving along in our path here. Because I'm just about ready to start getting into fabrication of more of what I just call more. So we can start using all the things to build all the things. And we'll start creating rail stops and all that fun stuff. Um, we're just going to kind of plop it down wherever I want because we got trains. So that's the beauty of trains. All right. Any train coming? I don't see one. Okay. All right. Let's come down here and take a peek at what's going on with our our yellow science we got blue chips wait what yellow science is whoa okay yellow science is not the problem what's the problem let's check our purple science uh, purple science is a problem okay so well we got the factories we don't have, so what's it missing? It's missing stone. Where's my stone? Wait, what happened? That's the output. That's the steel. Where's my stone? Uh. Wait, what happened here? Because this was running. Uh, something screwed up. That's output. That's input. Uh, you know what? I wonder if when I did my... When I lost my base saves, I wonder if this got messed up and I just didn't catch it. 
Well, I'll be darned. And we just must have had some, uh, some that was made. And so let's just come up here. We're going to do, I think we're just going to take it like right here into that belt. So that way it'll just, oh wait, here we go. Hold on. Wait, is this the belt for stone? Why is it empty? Okay, maybe I did have it. Um, did I screw up my belt? Um, is this too far? Is that the problem? Oh. Okay, I think I just... Okay, maybe I had it right and I just screwed up my uh, belt. When I was fixing the train tracks. Ah, okay. Well, I guess I don't need that other... Alright. So now, this should hopefully kick back into gear. It's like, whoopsie. Just make sure they're all connecting. Going through, going through. Here comes the stone. And that's probably going to impact some of our other science, because we have some coming down here as well. Whoopsie. That was a big... Boo boo. All right. Um. And I'm gonna probably drop one of these down here just so that way it'll help. Make sure we have full belts coming in here. Yeah, there we go. That looks a little better. All right. Let's come see here. Now we should have some. Railroads coming and purple science should be kicking out here in a sec. You can do it. Come on, buddy. Come on, give me some purple. And we got purple science back again. Okay. We should now start getting things produced again, thankfully. Yep, I should have paid attention to that a lot sooner. I need to put like a signal or something on this. All right, so once that finishes, we'll get our logistics. So that way I'm not wasting so much ammo on belts. Um, but to do that, we also need logistics bots. Um, so I'm gonna come over here where we have bots being made and I think I'm going to uh, add our bots in. Let's get past that before the train gets there. Oh, did that? Uh-oh. Okay, well, as long as that still works, I'll look at, I'll double check it shortly. Okay, so we got all of our stone coming in. Uh, this iron patch is just about done. Uh, well, let's fix it really quick while we're here. Let's get, uh, let's see, there, there. Let's kill that. Let's do... Let's do that, and then we'll just do kind of a... Yeah, like so. Let's kill that, and let's just drop a pull up here. Pull there. Pick you up. Pick you up. My goodness. Yeah, this patch is slowly drying up. Oops, oh, come on. Alright, well, let's just get this guy here. Let's see, uh, get another 
Do I have enough room to put it on this side? I do. Just gonna get you a power pole. There you go. Let's get every ounce of iron we can. And get you. Okay, I think that should do it. Let's get you taken care of. All right, so we got that cleaned up a little bit. Let's come on down. Ooh, I almost stopped on the train tracks. That would not have been good. Um, so let's see. We have... Okay, the frames, these things, we got lots of bots. Let's just do this for now. So logistics bots need red circuits in the flying frame as well. So this is going to go... This needs batteries. Uh, I guess I don't have batteries um, being made um, here. Dang it, I forgot. I was, yeah, I was importing them here. Grr. All right, well, I'm going to change this recipe here. Oh, wait, no, I can't because it needs red circuits. Um, well, shoot. Uh, let's see. All right, let me, I'm going to think about this for a second, and then we'll be right back. Okay, I think I'm going to, I think I figured out how I'm going to kind of route all this stuff, and our lab research has finished. So let's come in here and let's get our logistics on track. And then let's get the Logi bots being built. So we need these ro these frames, but to do that we also need batteries. So we're going to come in here and get a chemical plant. Um, and I'm bringing some sulfur over, so we're gonna kind of do something like this. See, so we're gonna make batteries. And actually, I need to scoot that up a little bit. I think. Let's do this, and then we can go, let's go get our chemical plant again. Boom, and go battery. Then we need some iron and copper, um, which we have some down here already kind of, oh no we didn't, I did a mix of that. <laughs> okay, go figure. All right, uh, let's get, let's uh, steal some iron and copper here. So let's do this, and I'm going to do a kind of a, a little thing here. I'm going to do a double, but I'm going to have this be copper. Not that, copper. And then this way I can just pull some copper over. Let me go down one, and then we're going to kind of go boom, boom, like so. And then we can bring... Oops, no, no. Let's get that fixed. Boom, and then we're gonna go this way here, and then we can kinda just do a route up and in. And now we have iron and copper, we can just kinda do like so. Like so. There we go, and now we'll have batteries being produced. So what I need to do is have, let's see, this kind of going like so, I think. Kill that, and then we're gonna put this right there, so that way I'll also use those. I can actually take that one off. And then we can just kind of do this, and then we can kind of do a, right? And then I need it to go to this side. So let's do,
like so. So that'll start letting the frames get be produced, and then we're gonna come down here. Now this guy is gonna keep producing about six more, and then we're gonna create another unit up here, I think. Let's do that. Let's. Um, I'm gonna take this, and we're gonna curve and go up. And then let's just let's do this. And this is going to curve and go up. Like so. And we'll just do a boom and a boom. And we're going to come in here and say logistics box. And then we just got to get a drop of power pole down here. Get all these things happy and create another box and boom and then we should have logistics drones we have drones so we're just going to set a limit there for as well so that's that should do it uh yeah let's see is this thing making it it is so we now have production uh, it is slow those these frames are really really slow uh, let's see modules do I have let's uh let's create one of those uh, what's it doing oh it's got all that stuff so we're gonna get this productivity module and I'm gonna stick it in here and then let's see the other thing that we did unlock is these beacons we have the stuff here we can probably do this here too uh, let's grab that where'd that uh, module go uh, there it is Bloop. so that way we get some extra product every now and then so that's Gee, plus four percent. Woo! Okay. Yeah, it's just a level one though. That's why. Okay, so if we have these beacons, needs green, red, steel, and copper. So what I could do is something a little janky. Maybe. Is this gonna reach? If I did this, if I remove, oh wait, hold on, I removed the wrong one. <laughs> let's do that, okay. If I do this, let's see, do that. And then let's, uh, actually let's take that off. Let's move that back one. Because what I can do then is just go, bloop, right? And then I can say, give me copper coils, give me red circuits, give me green circuits, give me steel, and give me beacons. Oh, dang, that was quick, pretty quick. So now we got our requester chest. We have our buffer chest. Let's see, request specified items be available for personal logistics and automated construction. Okay. Sends its contents to the logistic network. Okay. Interesting. So I guess I unload into blue, purple, maybe? If I look at this pattern here, blues is what I want. So maybe, okay, maybe I unload in the green chests, and then I have the blue chests with the Logibot. Okay. All right, so let's start getting to the next level of stuff here. So we also need to start getting to white science here soon. 
um, which is going to need, let's see, we need this rocket control unit. So let's get this rocket control unit and say start research. And yeah, okay, let's, yeah, that'll work for now. Okay, so this is going to get us a beacon right here. If I if I did this right, this will get us beacons. Go boom. Little janky build, you know. But hey, I can get it all to fit. Then I'll be happy. And all this is doing is just piping the, the output of this right into it, and it's going to be slow because it's just one feeding it, but. At least they're going to be made. We have our we have ten logistics bots started, so that's good. So now we have uh, so we have these things here. So I have yellow chests, and wow, I got a lot of yellow chests. Okay, so let's do this. Let's um, let's see. Can I change the recipe over to green? Uh, needs steel chest, which needs electric. Okay, let's do some green. Uh, this needs green circuits. Oh, I broke my green circuits. Okay, some green circuits. And then the red chest is also the same. Let's make some... Uh, see, that's the green chest, which is the buffer. Yeah, and we need some blue chests. And let's go ahead and do that. Uh, let's go like that. We have so many of these, we don't really need that many. Let's do something like that. And then that's going to give us, well, that's seven already. So I'll take those. And I'll take those. And do I have... Okay, I have some RoboPorts. So let's come up here. And we're going to grab some of these logistics bots. We have a whopping 13. And where's my car? Oh my goodness, I left it way over there. Let's go get our car. And then we're going to go add uh, this chest. And I'll go check out these tips. Uh, we're going to go back up north to our, where we have our uh, depot, or not our depot, but our drop-off for all the artillery shells. We're going to swap it over so we don't waste so many. Uh, and then I'll be right back. Okay, I saw a bit of a traffic jam on our way over here, but we're going to... Let's clean this up first. Let's um do this, because we don't need this anymore. No, no, no. Uh, let's go boom, 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 boom. pick you guys up. Uh, I don't have any room. Okay, let's uh, take that there. And we need buffer. Or no, we need uh, red chest. I think that's what we need. So there's red chest. Let's get a... Uh, and I know it needs to be inside the yellow... So let's uh, come over here. Let's get it right on the edge of the yellow here. Let's do that. And then we'll just come over here. And I think the yellows have to be connected for it to work right. From a logistic standpoint, at least from the sourcing Maybe the distribution? We can try it. Let's let's try. No, nope. okay, yellows have to be connected. So let's just uh get those and then we're gonna switch. Uh well I don't have any way to just do the switch. Um let's do Shoot, that's going to need a lot of boxes. Um, actually, let's do a buffer. Uh, well, 
actually, no, I can do a red chest here for now. And let's just do that to start offloading some of it. And then what we can do then is do a requester chest, right? I think that's what we do. Well, here, let's look at this really quick. So reds and then the blues. Yep, okay. So that's kind of what I want. What's the buffer? Uh, the stuff goes there. Da, 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 da. Got it. Okay, I think I, I think I got it. Let's do this, and then we can do that, I guess. And then we just come here and go, let's do 20, and say we want artillery shells. Uh, 20, I guess. And then let's come over here. And we got some logistics bots. Let's drop them in the network. Let's see, is that going to do what we need? It does. Perfecto. Okay. Uh, so that's got to have 48 in it for now. Jeez, this is going to take me a little bit. Okay. Um, <laughs> yeah, I probably should have changed how I did that. So, buffer chest, uh, I didn't read that, okay. Active provider, see, requester, markers red. Actively tries to push its items to the logistics network. If there are no requests for item, we'll move to a storage chest. Got it. And got it, okay. Well, I think I'm going to try to get these switched out, um, but I am full. So let's kick off our next research while we wait. Um, let's go and get our train uh, to, for high speed, and uh, we'll get things moving along. So we're going to do some cleanup of this, and we'll come back next time and hopefully start adding some more artillery to our process and get some more logistics going. So this is Techno Paladin. If you've stuck through this whole episode, I appreciate it. Remember to hit that like, comment, subscribe button, and all that good stuff. And we'll be back next time for some more Factorio. Thanks for watching. Good night.